Hey YouTube, this is the unboxing of the Incident Tech GTAR. Enjoy. So we'll try and do it in pieces. Um, but the GTAR from Incident Tech um, arrived today. And I uh, wanted to give some people, uh, not too many people invested in it, but some people an idea of the unboxing. So um, you can see their logo insignia made for iPhone on the side, the color of the guitar. Mine is black. Cut the tape here. Sorry for the uh, camera work. So you can see, uh, you probably shouldn't walk on the box, and um, and uh, it's good uh, to have an umbrella with it. And uh, it looks like don't try and put it in a wine glass. So, <clears throat> opening up, you can see the uh, GTAR back there. This is a wonderful extra from the. Uh, Awesome team at Incident Tech and Eden get a uh, t shirt from them. And uh, here's the actual guitar in the case. Okay, so it's uh, inside the bag and coming with, packed with it. Um, in this bag, uh, there is a wall charger. It's a USB. It's like a DC AC adapter there, USB cable, there's the headphone jack adapter, and uh, the smart pick here, Let's pick it out, so you can see that, it's uh, not required according to the site, but Also in the bag is a this is a hex key Allen wrench and two other picks in there. Okay, so now to the guitar itself. Pull it out. Show you the back. There are the book bag style straps on the back of the. This is a tough nylon. High quality feels um, nice, nice and strong. Build quality of it. There's a, another uh, strap for hanging, and two handles on the case itself. Move oh, the box. Lay this down flat for you. Okay. Let's unzip this. Alright, so I'll try and go through it as quick as I can. Really, it's a little bit later in the day now, but I'll show you some of this. The guitar itself. <clears throat> this one was actually signed by Eden and the team at Incident Tech. I had requested it, and they're awesome. They actually got some paint pens and signed it for me. You can see um, the iPhone dock here, and um, it's kind of hard to explain, but the uh, the mechanism itself is pretty neat. It holds it very securely at the uh, iPhone 4S, at least, right in place. It rotates in the base here, and then you pivot it down, and this little clip will actually slide. It's hard to show, but will lock the phone in place, actually holding onto the bezel of the iPhone. And running up the neck of the guitar, you can see 
in the fretboard and I guess because of the electronics there are because it's electronic there are breaks in each one of the frets you can kind of see the black between as you go up the guitar itself is uh, pretty heavy um, feels very nice the similar weight to a, a Fender entry level electric guitar uh, back plate and then there is a another door in the back I, I don't really recall exactly what this was for but um, looks like some sort of a controller microcontroller or something like that that uh, looks to be replaceable and there are below that the pins um, actually if you were to restring the guitar that's uh, the very end of the string um, there are um, here a couple little rubber caps on the edge cover up screws Alright, so now the, uh, obviously you've got the uh, straps holders here on both sides and then around the very bottom, the back side of the guitar, there's some inputs here. So you've got, um, the first one here is for the um, smart pick that I mentioned earlier. The next one is a USB input used for charging and I don't know if it has connectivity to it if you were to plug it into your computer or not, I'm not sure. And the last one is the headphone jack, or excuse me, a power button before that, and then the headphone jack. Overall, the guitar feels awesome. The weight of it specifically uh, makes it feel great. And if you move over here to the case, what comes inside the top pack. There are the option that I chose. This is the optional wooden pick guard that will... Um, unscrew and you can replace there. It, this is um, actual wood. Uh, real wood. I'm not sure what type of wood it is but uh, it uh, definitely is real wood. Here is a, uh, a fact sheet. Try to get my iPhone to focus in on it for you. Quick facts. How to set it up. How to rock your phone. Rotate your phone into it. Docking it and some legal disclosures and whatnot in the back side. A uh, thank you card from Incident. There you go. Nice added touch there. Uh, some stickers. A GTAR sticker. And uh, a couple other ones in there as well. And this is the second set of strings. So that was one of the things that's mentioned <coughs> on this card again. That's what comes with the guitar. The guitar itself, a quarter inch to eighth inch audio adapter, replacement strings, a USB power adapter, USB cable, guitar guitar strap, and the bag. So the strap is actually located in the top pocket here of the bag. Here. And then to move on to the uh, something in this bag just to go over it for everyone. The first thing you do, some people want to see is this smart pick. Um, uh, about the same size as a regular pick. Here you can see the tip is um, metal, looks like stainless steel. Pretty thin, and then it's connected. Uh, I would say close to 18-inch cable. I played with it for a little bit, and um, works just fine. The cable doesn't seem to get in the way because of the location of how it sits into the phone. I mean, excuse me, sits into the guitar. Um, 
uh, but the majority of the time when I was playing it, I was just using my fingers to strum the guitar and uh, finger picking. So <clears throat> this is the uh, standard USB cable for charging. There's two standard picks. And this is the quarter inch to eighth inch headphone adapter. So you can listen to your headphones. The sound quality when you're just using the standard iPhone speakers when it's docked is uh, fairly loud, definitely loud enough for you to hear it. But you can um, definitely hear the strings um, additionally. And if the strings, uh, obviously, they're not real pickups for the strings, so you're listening to some um, untuned noises in the background over top of the um, noises coming out of your phone. Like so. This is the uh, power adapter for the USB cable for the charging. It's uh, similar to that Apple setup. This is a um, nice, nice hard plastic. Still, it uh, definitely seems uh, it's quality. I wouldn't doesn't feel cheap. A little, definitely not as um, not as sturdy feeling as the guitar itself. That uh, build quality of the guitar is just uh, top notch. I'd have to say this is, um, you know, uh, better than something that you buy at the dollar store for sure to charge your iPhone with. Um, but uh, that, that's pretty much it. I will um, post more videos for you and for anyone if you have any questions or want some specific pictures I'd be happy to shoot it for you. Um, I can uh, shoot more videos and look forward to putting some stuff up of uh, me playing. I'm uh, by no means a guitar player but I'm interested in the technology side of this and seeing how well this can help me progress with playing. Yeah. Uh, thanks for listening and watching.